I'm Debbie Godfrey. Welcome to the Positive Parenting Pep Talks podcast. Have you ever thought about what happens when you make a mistake as an adult? Some of us are really critical of ourselves. Some of us are very hard on ourselves. And other of us has lear have learned that mistakes just happen and we've learned to grow from them and to learn from them and to deal with them. Well, how we deal with mistakes is often rooted in how mistakes were, ha were handled when we were a kid. So how was it for you? If you made a mistake, if you spilled your milk or if you broke something or if you, um, you know, made a mistake in any way, were your parents critical? Were they kind? Did they help you figure out how to fix it? Did they yell and scream and punish you and then fix it for you so that you never really got to learn how to fix your own mistake? These are the things that we want to consider when we think about teaching our own children about how, what happens when they make a mistake. It's important to have a philosophy on this at home that you and your spouse, if you're parenting with somebody, can get on board with so that when children make mistakes, you have a way that you're handling them that's consistent and that teaches them your values for what you want your children to learn about what happens when they make a mistake. Now, for me personally, I think I go to a little bit of an extreme with this, but I'll share you my story and then you can decide between the two of you what you wanna do in terms of handling mistakes. And what I learned about mistakes as an adult is that they just happen. And when mistakes happen, people come in and support you and help you and you can grow from them, you can learn from them, and great things can happen. So I wanted to teach my children that same philosophy about making mistakes. And so if they make a mistake, let's say they spill their milk, I might actually clap and go, yay, you made a mistake. Now, some people think this is crazy. Why would you do that? Well, the first part of getting kids to be more accepting of their mistakes is to celebrate the mistake because what you're celebrating is not that they made a mistake, that the thing is broken, that something's ruined, but what you're celebrating is the opportunity for learning, the opportunity to grow, the opportunity to have a new outlook on your world or a new vision of what can be possible. So the first thing is to, to do the little celebration. Now, if you have a child who's very self-critical, who's very hard on themselves, you don't want to do this because they'll get upset. So know your child and know whether they can handle this fun little clapping and celebrating the mistakes because some kids can't handle that. And then right after I celebrate the mistake, then I'll wrap it up with the learning. So I'll look at my child and I'll say, well, what have you seen me do when I spill the milk? And they'll kind of go, uh, clean it up great idea. Here's a sponge. Do you need any help with that? And so immediately follow up the celebration with the learning, the fixing, the repairing of the mistake, the solving of the problem, the creating a solution to whatever the mistake caused. So this is a quite a different philosophy than many of us were raised with, quite a different philosophy when you're thinking of raising your kids this way, but I found it very effective for my own kids to be more accepting of themselves and less critical of themselves. Have a great day. Happy parenting. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of the Positive Parenting Pep Talks podcast. For those of you that don't know me, I'm Debbie Godfrey, owner and founder of PositiveParenting.com. I hope you'll go and check out my website and follow me on Instagram and let me know about what you thought about today's episode. Did you learn something new? Were you able to do something different with your children? Did you have a success story? Those are my favorite to share. Let me know. Contact me. I'd love to hear from you. And also, what future topics would you be interested in hearing about on the Positive Parenting Pep Talks podcast? Thank you so much for being here and for all of your support. Take care and happy parenting. Hey!